Hi, I'm Unish Johar and you're watching me on Rolling Frames Entertainment. So I have now jotted down a few key takeaway points why uh, pursuing a hobby or maintaining a passion is very important in maintaining a work-life balance. The first and foremost point that I believe is focus. You know, like I'd mentioned before also, I used, I, I have a very short attention focus span basically. And for me, running works in developing focus. I have now developed a lot of focus in my work, in my activities, and this has really helped me a lot. Next up, I have productivity. You know, when you have a hobby, it helps you de-stress. It kind of gets you away from all your dull drudgery kind of stuff and you kind of come back very refreshed and recharged. It's like, you know, somebody's charged your batteries. You're like the Duracell bunny, you know, you're fully charged and ready to go. So your productivity levels automatically kind of come up. You can notice it anything, any hobby that you might pursue, it works for you in a positive manner. Next, I have another important point is mental strength. For me, while running has really helped me develop my mental strength and it's helped me kind of develop a very positive frame of mind. You know, it, uh, they say running kind of helps you fight depression, all these kind of things. For me also, it's worked very positively. I've become a much more stronger person mentally because while you're running, you face a lot of challenges. You know, you might develop blisters, your legs hurt, your mind keeps saying no, 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 give up. Your legs eventually after some time say, no, I'm not going to run anymore. The battle then basically becomes between your mind and your legs. And eventually you have to train your mind. And as soon as you learn to train your mind, you have actually won the battle. And that's how your mental strength really comes up. Another important thing is while you're running such long distances is you have your thinking time. You know, this is your time. You're alone. You can think about various things. You can think about projects, what you want to do in the future, about anything. Basically, like I use this time to think about what is going on in my company. How can I improve things further? You know, what can be done? What kind of new improvisations we can then Sometimes I end up thinking about client projects and, you know, at times some of some great ideas come to you while you're running because you know you're thinking this is all your me time so to speak you know you're all alone so you can think analyze and keep moving on with another important uh, benefit which goes without saying for running is health they say health is wealth and uh, with running your health is uh, obviously you know you build up a fantastic health the best thing is i have a lot of white hair i'm 42 but my running app says your age is 20 makes you feel good every day in the morning you look at the app says oh wow your age is 20 years old your physical fitness is that of a 20 year old and uh, maintaining health is very important you have to realize at the end of the day whatever work you're doing you are running a business you want to run the business for a longer period of time if your health is going to suffer you're never going to be able to run the business properly so health is very very important another important uh, key takeaway is uh, it helps you lower your stress levels. In today's society, we are all, you know, very wired. You know, we are constantly looking at stuff. You have your phones, emails, WhatsApp, you know, social media. So one point is while running, I never carry my phone with me. So, you know, that automatically kind of helps you de-stress is you are cut off from your phone, you don't carry your phone. And it's not only me, I have noticed that with perpetually every runner that I know, they hardly carry their phones. They keep their phones in their cars or they leave them at home. And uh, you know, it helps you kind of de-stress and break away from the monotony of everything. So at the end, I would also like to summarize all of this is, my hobby is running, but your hobby, you can choose whatever poison you like. You know, if uh, cooking works for you, Go ahead and cook. If you like to code, go ahead and code. If you like watching movies, watch movies. You know, if you like eating, if that works for you, go ahead and eat. But the idea is pursue your passion. You know, pursue it with your heart and soul and you will see how it reflects in your work life. It will automatically and dramatically increase. This is Munish Johar and you're watching me on Rolling Frames Entertainment. Thank you.